In this video, we solve homework problem 2.4.5 from the Essentials of Statistics text, 6th edition by Mario Triola. And the problem statement says, the table provided below shows paired data for the heights of a certain country's presidents and their main opponents in the election campaign. Construct a scatter plot. Does there appear to be a correlation? So I wanted to make this video so that I could show you how to construct a scatter plot using Excel. So it says click the icon to view the data table for election heights. So we can look at it here, but if you select this button here, it says click to copy table. I'll click that and then I will open it in Excel. And then let's open Excel. There it is. We've got um, the data for that homework problem. So you just want to highlight all of that data and then go to insert. And on my ribbon, I have this picture of a scatter plot. So I just choose the first one that says scatter. And I've that I got exactly what I wanted right here. Now I'm going to compare the graph that I have um, that I've just created using Excel to the graphs that are available in the MyLab Statistics um, homework uh, page. <laughs> okay, so they have the, um, their graph as, as very square. So I'm going to go back to Excel now and I'm going to make it square just by changing the dimensions of this graph here. So, oops, let's undo that. So I'm looking for a scatter plot that looks roughly like this on the MyLab statistics site. And I think A and D are most similar to the graph I have in Excel. So I, now I have to go back to my Excel graph and differentiate between the two. Notice we've got like four uh, data points that are going up like this and then four that are kind of coming down. And I don't see that in graph D, but I do see that in graph A. So graph A must be our scatter plot. So we'll select that one, check our answer. Okay. And then the question says, does there appear to be a correlation between the president's height and the opponent's height? Well, I'll just look at that that scatter plot, does it appear to be linear? Does it make sense to put a line through this data and use that line to approximate the relationship or um, to predict the relationship between an opponent's height and a president's height? I don't think so. I don't think that that represents a line at all. The, the, the little um, uh, points are all, uh, they're everywhere. So I would say no, there does not appear to be an, a, a correlation because there's no general pattern to the data. And I was talking about a linear correlation, but there could be other types of correlations as well. But there doesn't appear to be any type of pattern there. So no, the answer is no. And that's it. So that's how you create a scatter plot in Excel and answer questions like this one.